Hello and welcome everyone to another episode of Game Vortex and Vitali and today it has been announced that Nintendo will finally show off the Nintendo NX with about a three minute trailer that is coming out if I'm not mistaken today uh, at 10 a.m. Pacific time so it gives us another I don't know eight hours or so left until the announcements by the time you probably watch this video it's gonna be uh, a few hours left only I just wanted to give you a quick update on what's been happening with the channel and why there hasn't been any videos. Uh, basically, there are a couple of reasons. One of my, my best friend came over uh, about a week, two weeks ago, so I had to drive him around, show him the country, and basically uh, I was away from my laptop and everything else. And as you can see right now, I'm not at home as well. We finally had our baby girl yesterday. It was actually very unexpected. Uh, it had to be a, like a, a surgery done straight away at that day. So uh, the original date was supposed to be um, around the 3rd of September or something like that. So right now my wife is still in the hospital and I'm with her as well. I just came out to buy some things from the local supermarket. In any case, so that's the reason why the video has been, been missing for a while. So things will get a bit tough from here on. Uh, for me because I have to look after the little one as well. I already have one daughter as well uh, But I'll try to do my best so don't get disappointed eventually I'll have to move uh, a bit further away from my wife uh, because I have to get back to work So let's talk a little bit about the Nintendo NX now I predicted in my previous video I actually told you that they're gonna announce it not later than October I actually said maybe even November uh, because they certainly need they have very little time left they said it will hit in March so production and everything else has to be ramped up you have to create a nice hype you have to get the marketing right uh, thank God because they cannot afford another miss Nintendo cannot afford another miss so they only said that it's gonna be a trailer of three minutes so I wouldn't expect too much obviously you probably won't find out the price for sure uh, I think they won't mention the price uh, too early for that. I think you'll find out the price uh, somewhere before the launch Maybe a month or two before the launch uh, Maybe they'll hint at one. I think what we will see is What it actually is how is it looks like and what does it do in a brief, you know, probably some kind of a like uh, Most likely it's gonna be just some footage of people playing it and how it's supposed to be used uh, we'll see if it's actually corrected as, as we were talking before if it's a tablet with detachable controllers with a part of power module and with the dock uh, I'm very excited to be honest. I really 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 am excited because there hasn't been a proper hardware announcement uh, In a while. I'm actually probably more excited about the NX right now than I am about the PlayStation 4 Pro or the Scorpio because it's actually something different and it's something that they managed to keep a secret for so long and I'm praying God that it's running on Tegra X2 that way we'll, we'll have easy ports from uh, proper games from PS4 and Xbox One because Nvidia released a special SDK basically that makes it very easy to port PC games onto uh, the Tegra chipset, which is a mobile chipset, obviously. So I hope that you will join me as well in watching this video. And now is the last chance to see what you're actually expecting from it and what it's going to be. I think that we will have a much better. Fucking hell! Sorry, the traffic is just horrendous. I think we'll have a a much better understanding of what it actually is and what does it do but I don't think that all the questions will be answered in this video you mustn't forget that it's actually only three minutes long and probably some of it is gonna be some gameplay footage and stuff I actually hope that they take it and try to explain the customer of what exactly is it what can it do and why should people care that's the only way they need to generate the buzz for the system uh, because if, if it's gonna have more questions than answers at the end of that video that will mean consumers or potential buyers probably not gonna be excited about it. and that's where they need to come out and clarify bits and pieces of whatever is left my prediction that I think that the rumors were true that it will be uh, basically some kind of a portable hybrid thing between the 3ds and a Wii or Wii U, whatever you want to call it. 
So I think, I'm not sure if it will have the power module, you know, it seems a bit off that you'll have to, I actually hope that this thing is with power module, if it actually is true, then that means there's going to be controllers, tablet, lower power tablet, sorry about that, thank you, so I think that this power module, if it happens to be true, it's, it's a bit of an awkward thing, it's an exciting thing and it's a hassle at the same time. You have a low power tablet which probably won't run much uh, i was actually hoping that the power module would be in the dock so you have less parts to carry around with you however having said that i also think that having that power module is a kind of a good thing if you still want to get the same quality graphics while you're on the go whatever or not the battery is going to be good it's it i don't know that's a Screen and battery and CPU, GPU, that's all I care about in this console, to be honest. And I'm not after graphics, but I want to make sure that it's competitive on the market when it actually launches. That it's not like, if, if, if it's going to be so low power that they can't port g current games from PS4 and Xbox One, then, then I'm just pissed off, because I'll be pissed off, because no matter what Nintendo pulls out from their exclusive lineup, You've seen the success the Wii U had, and I'm saying success in a bracket. If there isn't anyone supporting your hardware from the third parties, or if it's going to be like last time, they'll support it, nobody buys it, and they'll just run away. Then the NX is doomed, but I hope they are smarter next time. I hope they got their act together, I hope they got their fucking online infrastructure uh, properly set it up. So the people don't have to suffer anymore and we'll see if this is the new nintendo after the water passed if they actually learned something from their mistakes so today probably if i'll have some spare time and i'm not gonna fall asleep because i've been with my daughter for most of the time then we had a bit of a complications there so it was quite worrisome uh what i'll do is that as soon as the trailer hits i'll make another video right in the hospital and I'll upload it. Hopefully the upload there is nice. I mean, the download speeds are quite good. Uploads, I'm not sure. So, there we go. Um, thank you very much for watching this video. And I will see you all on the next episode of, you know, Game Vortex, which is going to release tonight. It's probably going to be a big lack of editing in these kind of videos, but I hope you understand all the situation that I'm going through right now. Thank you very much for watching again. Subscribe to the channel, help me out, uh, comment on the video below. I always re try to reply to every single comment that I see. Uh, and thank you again, and I'll see you all next time.